Hello people, greetings to you all and I welcome each and every one of you on board to my channel Mr. Versatile Naga. My name is Ajahn Humjui connecting from Delhi, India and today I'll be speaking about the airport jobs or the ground staff jobs like how to start your professional career in the aviation sector or how to start working at airport jobs, ground staff jobs. So if you're a graduate student and if you're looking forward to start your career in the aviation sector or any airport jobs and services, you have landed in the right video. So it's my humble request to each and every one of you to please watch the full video till the end. So in order to begin, let's talk about the eligibility criteria in order to work at the airport. So the first thing is you must have a graduation certificate from any board or a recognized university. That is the first thing. And the second thing is you must be of at least 21 years of age in order to start working at the airport. So there is a second thing and third thing is you must have a valid passport, GOI passport, a government of India passport is a valid documentation in order to start working at the airport. So if you don't have a passport, I urge you to apply it right now. Uh, you can check it, you can Google it on the passport server and you can apply it in the portal itself. So after receiving the passport, you can apply for the jobs. You can Google it and you can check in the airline carrier page and then you can apply it accordingly. So the, uh, these three things are the f very important things in order to start working at the airport. So let's talk about the communication skill now. So communication skill plays a very important role in each and every jobs in the hospitality and aviation industry. So if, if you're having a good communication skill, you have an advantage, you, you have a plus point because the, during the interview, the HR will ask you the questions like uh, how did you spend your day yesterday or tell me something about yourself or what do you know about globalization, what is child labor or she or she might ask you about the advantage and disadvantage of social media, advantage and disadvantage of nuclear family and advantage and disadvantage of technology, whatever, whatever she comes in her, in her mind, she or she, the person will gonna ask you during the interview. So it, it is very important to stay prepared before your interview. So I urge you to research in the Google, like what are the questions, interview questions and answers asked during the ground staff job interview. So accordingly you prepared and you know, do your best during the GT round. GT round will be, it consists of uh, 10 to 15 people. It's a GT means a group discussion. So you will be given a single minute of time, each one minute each, and you have to speak on the given topic. Suppose if I ask you about the uh, child labor, you have to say that in a given one minute. So your English must be very good, must be cleared, a strong communication skills without adding any words like uh, mm, without mumble, without murmuring or without any uh, stammering you have to be you know speak in a very fluent way so it will add more advantage to the hr recruiter i and once you selected once you are selected uh, for the interview you know there will be a medical test there will be a hearing test there will be a eye test and if you clear that they will offer you an appointment letter and you can you know you can directly report uh, when the when they give you a reporting email in your personal email id so before uh, before going for an interview before going for an interview some some things which are very important and necessary is you know uh, you have to be physically fit and medically fit before because uh, in order to work at airport you must be well groomed first thing and you must have a good personality development you know, because we gonna deal with the passengers, with the customers during our shift time. Our work is not a seated, uh, you know, it's not a seated work sitting in front of the computer. We'll be dealing with the passenger eye to eye, face to face. You know, we will be meeting each and every day different kinds of people from different nations, from different regions, from different nationalities. So we have to be, you know, very smart. We, we have to be very active. We have to be very vigilant, you know, when working as well. So and many people think that ground staff jobs you know they they look down on ground staff jobs but i will say that ground staff job airport aviation ground staff job is one of the respectable job in the private sector and in the aviation industry so if you're a project student i urge you to apply for a aviation for an aviation job role on ground on ground 
why it is called on ground job because we are not a pilot we are not flying the airplane we are not a flight attendant we are not a cabin crew we are not flying a plane that is the reason we are known as a ground staff but underground staff there are many sub departments like uh, aviation security customer service cargo catering staff xyz there are many departments so it is your wish once you clear the interview it is your wish to choose which sub department you want to choose for so during the interview you you will be given an opportunity to choose the various sub departments so accordingly you can choose that but as for me i'm an aviation security department i'm from aviation security department so i urge you to choose aviation security department why because aviation security like you know it's a very yeah, has been many advantages in various fields and it's a versatile job first thing because uh, security is not only needed in the airport job security is needed in in, uh, in each and every organization be it government organization be it private organization be it hospital be it education institution security when we talk about the security security is a versatile word and it has many advantages so or oh, you will have many exposure in the future once you start as a security you can go for cruise ship security after working as an aviation security officer so that will add more more advantages if you choose this security department so i urge you to please choose security department when you join as a ground staff in the airport jobs and about the qualification qualification is uh, you must be a graduate from any stream be it arts be it commerce or be it science that doesn't matter, but you should be the graduate student. You must hold the graduation certificate. That is the very thing. And the passport, like I said, it is very mandatory document. Uh, and you must be of 21 years age. And, you know, you must have a good communication skills. And if you have all these kind of things, of course, you can go for it. You can apply it in the company portal. Suppose if you are looking forward to go for Indigo, Indigo Airline interview, you can check it in the www go indigo.in in the website and you can click in the uh, indigo carriers and if you, likewise if you are wanting to go for air india you can check in www.airindia.com or airindia.in and if you are willing to go for vistara you can click it and uh, you can click it in the google by searching www.vistara.com so accordingly it will appear in the page in the company page and under the company page you tap on the carriers job carriers and it will find and if you're using social media like instagram facebook you must follow this indian aviation page and indian aviation carriers these are the uh indian aviation pages like they're they, they update they stay up to date about the jobs about the recruitment of be it cabin crew be it crowd staff or any other uh aviation related jobs they used to keep update up to date in the uh, instagram page and the facebook page so i will urge you to follow them and uh, Aviation app. Uh, I don't know whether you have heard about this map aviation carrier like it's a map aviation It's an app mobile application. So I will give you in the description. I will paste the link in the description So I urge you to download it through the link because map aviation carrier is a very helpful app uh, For the cabin crew experience for the aviation experience, you know, if you are willing to start your professional career in any aviation sector the map aviation carrier the gives you opportunity to apply for a uh, jobs in a particular airline so there will be uh, there will be option like air, uh, airport ground staff jobs and uh, cabin crew jobs international jobs so once you click that map aviation carrier uh, you will be asked to you know fill up uh, fill up some kind of inform for, uh, information and details personal details and after that uh, it's just like 79 rupees 99 rupees uh, like for a subscribe they just subscribe a uh, subscription fee but if you can waste uh, 100 rupees 200 rupees like in any you know in some stuff you why not you spend you know 99 rupees in order to subscribe the news channel so that you, you will be the first one to know about when the when particular airline is recruiting on certain department so i urge you to please download this map aviation carrier i'll uh, paste in my description so i request you kindly check out so yeah like we discussed these are all the things needed in order to start your career as a ground staff job so if you want to know more about the job role or if you want to know more about inside stories then you can pinch me you like you can comment you can pinch me in my instagram or you can comment in the uh, comment section that 
or you can give you can suggest me any idea on how to update how to update my content like for example last uh just three days back i i uploaded a video regarding about the capering group job so if you are a new member watching this video so i request you to check out that the capering group job so from here i'll be signing off mr Vastal Naga signing off thank you so much for watching my video